to. Oh, it is. Yeah, I can hear you better now. I can hear you real good. Good luck, everybody. Except, oh, second. Ooh, got that weapon swap. All right, head counselor Kenny. In my very 80s, very patriotic, well, pseudo patriotic gear. You can see I got red highlights on my shoes. That's the red and the red, white, and blue. And also a little bit on my shirt. Listen, it's the best I could do. I assume there's a good party police. I, I may just check that, but I kind of like this look. Because I usually go with the party police. So I tried to change up my look pretty dramatically for this particular Twitch event, which is me playing as patriotic counselors in Friday the 13th. Kenny is very solid as a counselor. Kenny is a five across the board on everything, so you can really just build him however you want to build him, you know, if you want to give him more uh, weapon speed or more strength or more stealth, whatever. That's the pluses about Kenny. He's really good at... He's good at everything. He's not great at anything, so you do have to keep in mind what perks you have on Kenny. Just making sure we don't miss anything. So with Kenny, I really just try to do what I do with most uh, repair counselors. Because I consider a 5, that's pretty much a repair counselor. You can get repairs done pretty fast with a, uh, somebody with a 5. There's no reason to put repair perks or, or anything like that on him. I'm only going to invite people I haven't invited yet, guys. I don't know who that We Got Bruno in the Metal is. This is what I'm going to do, y'all. I've been doing this a lot more often now. Now, see, this is not something I would do as a sack head, guys. You should always trap your shack. I triple trap my shack as sack head. To this, we say, get out of here with that bullshit. Because, see, I can just... What happened? He should be coming to me, guys. He should be coming to me. I'm at the shack. Yeah, he's at me. <laughs> Sackhead, you get away, bro. You don't want the smoke, dude. He's on me. He's on me. Hey, he's on me. I think I'm coming up to... I'm coming up to you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I came to, I had to run to the fat, uh, closest house. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> this can't be Might as well get in here. Alright. Hey, I don't even have any supplies. All I got is this bat. I mean, that's not what I meant. Jason, I got uh, two first aids and a knife. I was going to lock them all. I lock them all, bro. Well, get in here and lock this one, too. Jason's on us, guys. Jason's on us. I don't know where he went. Oh, he's back on me. He's back on me. I'm just running decoy. I'm not worried about it. Y'all go ahead and do whatever y'all want to do. I didn't mean to say I was running decoy, Jason. I meant to say I'm out here 
trying to bust your ass. Don't come up here with that bullshit, Jason. I think he left me, guys. Nope, nope, I hear the music now. Yeah, he's still here. <clears throat> as far as I know, he's still on me, but he might have just left. Nope, he's back. He's here. Jason, go away, dude. Bro, it wasn't even me that was saying that stuff about Pam, bro. I was talking about Pam's a good person. And she truly loved her son, Jason. And that's you, man. And it's a beautiful thing. So don't make this weird, Jason. Don't make it weird, Jason. Don't make me do stuff I don't like to do. I swore off of it. I swore off violence. No. I wasn't going to do nothing, Jason. He got me, boys. He got me. I think he's about to cut my dick off. Oh no, my penis! And now the rest of my bodies. I probably wouldn't be able to talk like this at this point. I'm dead, bro. They done got old, old Kenny. Old Kenny's dead, guys. R.I.P. to that man. But see, I wasted all their time, and look what happened. Look what we did. That was the whole point of that. Y'all got a full car, just leave, man! Oh, he must have morphed in front of him. I wonder who's driving. Oh, it's killer. Look at that ping. 220. Not, not the worst, but definitely not the best. Well, no, that's good. I'm glad they got out. That's the whole reason I tanked that. I, I went into the shack and everything. That was... That was... Thank you, uh, Kenny, for running a distraction so we could all escape. Thank you. GG's, guys. Glad y'all made it out. Uh, second, I believe. But it's okay. Yeah, Shang's still alive. He was... He was with me earlier when Sackhead was trying to kill us. <laughs> I got a spoiler, there's not much good on there. There's only about four songs, my dude. He finally just turned it off. Oh no, the keys will show back up. Yeah. I do that all the time. But it actually kind of helps, but then sometimes they'll spawn like really far away. Yeah, he was chasing me and Chad for the longest before that, before you guys got it started. <laughs> oh, this can't be happening. That's why there's no Tommy. Oh, he uh he knocked that generator, I'm sure. I know I I tried to fix one as Kenny and it almost got me killed. Because he was right there. Oh, man, he done got shanked. Oh! There you go. Let's see, he's not going to be able to fix that. <laughs> uh, just fun. Right. Oh, yeah. Alrighty, y'all. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that used to be a thing. Just groups of chads. I was talking the other day about how when I used to be a Jason main, and you'd show up into a random lobby and it'd be nothing but chads and Vanessa, and you'd be like, nope, 
<laughs> Not today. Not today, dickheads. Where did I spawn in? Uh, on the other side of the big, big road. That's where I'm... Ooh, there's a battery. No! Oh, yeah. It might have been, yeah. I ended up going the other way, and I, I distracted him. I ran into, I ran into his shack as Kenny, and then that's why he got distracted, and y'all were able to get that car out. Because me and Chad ended up running him for a good two, three minutes, and he ended up getting me on a shift. Probably not. I mean, he's a good player, but that's. Well, yeah, and it's Chad, so he can't really he can't really fix anything. Even if he hit every, even if he hit every skill check, it, it takes too long. And not having Tommy in, Tommy would help him a lot. Oh, he's a really good player. Shame. This guy's probably a good Jason. Oh I, man, I am the only person that died. Oh well. If my death gets everybody's. Well, yeah, he might. But, I mean, we got four people out, so that's all that matters. Especially on a high-level Jason, because he's got weapon swap, so he's at least a 113. <laughs> yeah, see, he's over there by that power box, but he can't fix it. Oh, yeah. Sometimes it works like that. Ooh, I hate this. I hate this cabin. Yeah, I guess that's probably because they think that you might give the other players pointers, like, hey, Jason's over here. Yeah, and he's got, he's got sack heads, so he probably still has, yeah, he's trapping the shit out of it. That's exactly what I would have done. That's exactly, that's smart. He might have a he might have a knife. I don't know. Hello. Ooh. Oh no! He's shaking on him. Don't shake on him, Chad. Oh no! Ooh. Ain't shaking now, are you, baby? He's got to have a first aid. He doesn't have a first aid. Oh no! Nah. He must not have a first aid. You want some more? Oh yeah, he's probably based on uh They're usually so the counselors are usually based on an amalgamation of different characters. Oh yeah, he's fucked. Jump out of a window, Chad! Suicide! It's the only one! Oh! No, he doesn't have a knife. GG's, GG's. Man, I thought I thought you was about to jump out that window, bro. I'd have, I'd have given you... I, I would have given you a, a 21 gun salute on that one. Jason. That's exactly what I would have done. I would I would have not given that that bastard Jason the satisfaction. <laughs> <laughs> GGs, GGs.